That's the dash that's in this at the moment. So it's a strip, VH strip dash. Something I'd look at doing because I've actually got a thing to run now. Let's prove that for a sec. Hang on. Me to be a bit of a bit of a liar. Well, that's better. Um, so nothing really works on this dash. So what I'd like to do is to swap it out and uh, look at how we're building our RT at the moment. Really? I'm in the, the cockpit of what needs to be done. I'm happy to do that with uh, hand tools. We are removing the dashboards around, which gracefully fell. Dashboard strip dash. Come out. Actually, I've not seen a video on this, so I'm actually quite happy to do this and muck it up and work out what I'm doing. Take all evening to pull out one screw. Now um, it's more than one. Just two more. It's going to be about a thousand behind it. So there we go. It's going to be interesting to do with one hand. Let's move those up there. Right, we want to go for now. Hang on, I'll come back in a sec. So we got that out. What was holding in was the speedo cable, and that was just a simple matter of screwing it out. So all of these should be just. Right, let's work out how to get these out, and I will.
Well, there's a big loom behind the dash and the lights itself just come out and then that's out. Push them in. Oh, yeah, there we go. Come on. This one really doesn't want to go. That's right into the loom. Right, let me work this out. Yeah, so I don't think that's, I don't think this dash is original, unless they did that from the factory. That was just um, a couple of wires done with leaky tape. Same with that one as well. I don't think this dash is original. Do that. Right, I think it's uh, another wire. Yeah, it doesn't look original to me at all. Right, so this should just. It's holding you now. Oh yeah, two down there. All right, let me do those and uh, we can get rid of this strip day. Let's remove that last, um, last bolt. It becomes a bit of a nightmare when you're looking at something like that. Alright, I'll get rid of that. I'll come back to you in a sec. Well, we should have our old dash out now. About, hopefully, just hung up on a few wires there, nothing. Majorly major. On there, but um, what we are replacing that with is an IT dash. So, <laughs> yeah. Let's um, see how we go with this little sucker. Oh, fitting into, oh, it's upside down. That wasn't a good introduction. So this little guy sitting in to our dash area. Let me figure a few things out and see what can be done this evening. I'd say it's a pretty good fit. Obviously it was meant to be in here. Um, so we've got the lights and um, let's going back into the lower dash. But, um, yeah, we've got lights into it, um, lights and brakes. that you know, let me just turn the ignition on and see what light comes on should be one might have to go through and check all of these but um, anyway There. Yes, there is my after dash fitting into my vouch charger. That's starting to look um, pretty special. 
We will give this a start. Ooh. That's not running on everything, so... I should go to the Tessa and see what's on and what's not. Here's that RT dash looks good. Alright, back to you. A few in. Um, I think the battery is in fuel, not the speedo, not the RPMs temperature I think and oil we don't have a sender for that so let's um fuel goes up to the max temp goes there <laughs> fuel sends cactus oh, there's our oh I think that's interesting so our RT dash is alive let me go and sort this out oh it's um it's an oil light that one, so it's the oil base temperature. So that's the, the full deal. Just a light in the previous lane. We the temperature jumping all around the place. Is the oil light? Yeah, right. I think temperature gauge is moving. All right, let me go and check that cubby out again. There we go, the VH. RC dash into a VH. So I've got um, temperature work and also the fuel gauge just whacking up to the top like the old one was. And um, as far as the amps go, yeah, we need to sort that out. But um, it's in miles per hour. So that should be as same as I had before. Let's give it one more start. A couple of spark plugs have died. Moving, fuel gauge is up, top, went bad sender. Charge is not moving. Haven't hooked up the tack. Oh, it's not a, it's just a light at the moment, which is that one. Yeah, five or two. Yeah, that's it. All right, done. Sorry, that wasn't the field light. That one was. All right, let's um sort this out. Yeah. 